rear part is in. So I've taped up the windows. I'm going to paint it with them out because they they insert from the outside, so that makes it nice and easy. Uh, so I thought I'd have a look to see how the uh, front clear piece is going to fit, and I'll just show you. It's going to be very difficult to fit this, I feel. It's got to be flexed around. So there's going to be a lot of choice words putting this in for sure. I can't see this going. Uh, I mean, it'll flex around to curve, but it's not fitting in here properly, so I don't know. I'm going to have to look at taking some plastic off up in, uh, up in here, I think, or try taking a bit out of the corners where it meets the top there. just doesn't look like fitting at the moment so that's going to be a lot of fun yeah on there I had a look at the ICM's got a video of it going together but that's just a um, 3D rendering of the parts and it just shows it going straight on well that ain't the case I'll just quickly show how I do masking up of clear parts um, unless the kit comes with a mask set, I usually just mask myself. I know some people don't like it. It's uh, let me turn it off a minute. Uh, it's I find it soothing. That might sound crazy, but I just like it. It's relaxing. Um, backlight is the key, so you can see your your uh, framework. I'm not sure how it's going to show because of the fluoro light, but there's a fluoro light. Uh, where possible, I'll run the tape along the uh, edge of the frame. And then, uh, this is a Stanley knife with, a, with the uh, blade you can snap off. It's segmented so you can keep uh, a sharp end. That's the key, have a sharp blade. And using your light, yeah. like so. Let's turn that off again and just. Continue on like that. I've done this one already. That was pretty simple that one But even your World War two bombers and that all all mask like that all right, Finished masking up the glass or the clear part uh, so I've Used a, a file. This is a triangle uh, diamond file and I've filed in these corners here gently to create more room to fit on here, which seems to have helped. It's still going to be a matter of you have to start on one side, glue it, let that set, and then uh, come along and then glue on the other side. I'll probably go the corners. Because I've noticed it doesn't look too bad now, but once I push them right down, there's a bit of a lip there, so I can come in from the inside and maybe push that out. But um, that's a lot better than before, anyway. And there's going to be a need for putty, but there would have been anyway, I would imagine. I can't see how a big clear part like that's going to be perfect. Uh, so I've masked this up inside. I'm going to paint it the interior colour. 
because uh, you'll be able to see it through the uh, doors. I'm not sure yet whether the doors will be open or closed. And this piece is going to go in here. It's not too bad a fit. Just this top corner need might need a bit of uh, adjusting to get it to sit in the right spot. But uh, yeah, so it's coming along. All right, it is on. That was an experience. Okay, so uh, the removing of the <clears throat> sanding away or filing some of the clear away from these corners helped it rest on this section, but still you got to bend it into the shape where it's got to sit. So I uh, started one section, glued it. Put some tape over it, hold it there, let it dry half an hour or so, and I moved around till I uh, got it in. It, I needed uh, some putty and areas. It, it didn't sit flush, I'll tell you that. And I'm not going to say that's the kit, could have been me. Uh, this one's in, this one fit much better than the windscreen section. <clears throat> I haven't glued the top yet because uh, this section will fit onto the fuselage and the front of the fuselage has a uh, oh, grab it. so we're going to be putting this slots on it goes right I'm not forcing it just yet because I'm don't want to break anything but so that goes right up, and this is part of your part of the cockpit. So there's some instrument panels, and that's going to go on here, the overhead ones. And so when that goes in, then we'll have this piece slots in top, and like so. Bring that in. It looks pretty good fit, so I'll, but I'm not gluing it to the clear section. Just to wait till I do this bit. I'm, <laughs> I'm looking for the least resistance as possible for this because it's so big. Yeah, uh, faults will stand out. 